Hi guys, this is Victor, aka Sergeant Rosie. Today's my first video on YouTube. I'm not a professional video editor or YouTuber by any means, so please be kind to me. Today I wanted to talk about what streamers call active lighting. If you look behind me on the walls, that's active lighting. Um, you'll see it like in a lot of YouTube videos or people that stream, and what it's meant to do is capture the viewer's interest. It's just a little bit more visually pleasing um, you'll see a lot of people, they'll use some kind of form of like incandescent lighting or LEDs, you name it. So anyways, I'm going to shift to a different angle and then we'll talk further about how hopefully I could save you a little bit of money. All right. So this video primarily is about how to hack a life FX beam. We're going to be using two products. We'll get straight to the nitty gritty. We're going to be talking about this LED light strip, and it's made by a company. It's called Govi Dream Color LED Light Strips. Okay. Super cool. And it's just a LED light strip. Okay. And a second product that you'll need is a LED aluminum channel. And what that consists of is a aluminum channel and a milky white diffuser. And what that's meant to do is your LEDs have like a, a, little, a little bulb on them and you don't want that just sticking on your wall. It looks really like junior high school or, you know, it just looks uh, not professional, not completed. So... I right, put this down. I'm going to show you real quick. The LED light strip is based on a 50-50 uh, design. Um, it means that it's 10 millimeters wide. And the aluminum channel that you're going to need is called a double wide channel. It means that it's 20 millimeters wide. So in theory, how I did mine, kind of hard to do with the camera here. But ultimately what you want to do... Well... You're going to run your LED light strip side by side in this channel. It's got a 3M adhesive on it. And when you run it side by side, you get essentially double the brightness. And something else that you guys need to know is for this LED channel, right where my index finger is at, there is a copper three pin uh, connector. And you can actually trim it as long as you cut it right on that spot, okay? So just remember the copper three-pin connector. You could trim these to fit your individual needs, okay? So anyways, I really like these. Uh, they work for me. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to help you guys save a, little bit of, save a little bit of money. Times are tough right now and every little bit helps, all right? <clears throat> all right, so... What I originally was looking at was a product called uh, the Nano Leaves, and they're like LED light panels that you kind of snap in together to kind of create different designs. I think these are super cool. I almost got them, but the thing about them is like when you see a lot of people that stream video games on Twitch, they're completely overdone. Um, and also the price, the price point. I mean, uh, I think that we're getting price gouged here. These people, their profit margins are astronomical. We're looking at $200, $300, $400 for, for lighting. Um, and if you could afford that, by all means, if you really like it, then it's completely up to you. A comparable product to the light strip that I just showed you is the Philips Hue. And these things are going uh, anywhere from $80 upwards of $160 for a LED light strip. Now the Life FX Beam, I really, really wanted to get these. Um, unfortunately, as you can see, they're completely sold out. You can't get them on this website, Amazon, or Best Buy. But I'm going to show you how to make them today. And it's essentially almost the same exact thing. And for that price point of 140, 150 bucks, you can make five five of these LED uh, self-contained lights, okay? So we're gonna get straight to it. 
I'm going to be sure to uh, link these products in the uh, description to the YouTube video. So the LED light strip is made by Govi, and it's called the Dream Color. They come in two different lakes, 16.4 and 32.8. To make the ones that I'm showing you, you're going to want the 16.4. And what's really cool about these is they are Wi-Fi. So it'll work with uh, Google Assistant or Amazon Alexa. Whenever I want to come down to my man cave and uh, get my game session on, I just say, hey, Alexa, lights on, and it's, uh, it's time to go. Another cool thing about them before I uh, swap screens here is they're RGBIC, which means like they're twice as bright as conventional LED light strips, but also it means they're completely addressable. So instead of having a single solid color, like green, red, yellow, you could uh, have multiple colors going on at the same time all in one light strip. Uh, you know, you could have rainbow waves and all kinds of stuff if, if you're into that sort of thing. And the last piece of the puzzle to complete the project is the uh, aluminum LED light strip channels. And this is made by, I think it's like a Chinese company called Muzada. What's important about these is you need to get the ones that are called double row. Um, that way you could double up your light source, guys. That way you could get twice the brightness. You just double them up, run them side by side. And uh, essentially that's it. I hope you like the video. Um, it helped me out a lot if you give me a follow. I stream uh, here on YouTube and also on Twitch. Username Sergeant Rosie. And have a good day. We'll talk to you next time. Bye.